the right move, just a little too much force. It's a great floater shot, though. Both teams struggling from the field early on in this ball game, but Kayla, both teams have really been working inside the three-point arc. And Josh, both teams also like to push the ball. You can already feel the intensity of this game as they're running the floor. Atkinson, up and under, Daniel. He was number 59 in the ESPN rankings for the 2015 class, the number 10 center, so or Columbus. And now he's found his way into the starting lineup for John Becker in Burlington. Atkinson has all four points so far. For about 34% shooting from the field this year. That's pretty low offensively, and that's credit to Yale's defense. They're smart, they have their hands high, and they know how to contest shots. That's the best mark in the Ivy League, and it kept Ryan Davis, who just checked in from hitting his first shot attempt for the Catamounts. Bulldogs are holding opponents to about 64 points per game. That's third best in the Ivy League. Still early on in this action, however. Nice slip. Atkinson underneath, threw some contact and a strong finish. Duncan, one of the two captains for this Vermont team. That's the team's second. And Atkinson gets the shooter's bounce. Leads the team with 16.9 points per game. That's fifth most in the Ivy League heading into today. Love that ball being high, especially because that, you know, it was a little bit of a lob pass, created some time in between, but he was able to finish it. Davis has given this team some really good minutes off the bench, but that time Atkinson slips high. Bruner, he's into double figures. Strong take on the other side, but Steph Smith was too strong. Back to an eight-point lead for the Bulldogs. Well, we've seen two pretty big dunks so far from Yale to start this second half. Now Atkinson lays it in. It's back to an eight-point game. Swain, pull up. Atkinson the follow. Monroe needs help. Has Gabadon. Atkinson against Lamb. Spins around him, and he goes with the reverse finish. Beckett goes around the screen. Atkinson took it away, keeps it in play. Mahoney overhand pass to Bruner. Good teamwork there for Yale to not just gain possession, but not lose it in the process. Bulldogs still lead by nine, nearing eight and a half to play. Atkinson inside, too easy. Left. Swain directs traffic, the native of Brockton, Massachusetts, attended the Rivers School outside of Boston. Just behind the free throw line, Atkinson back to the hoop, and the floater falls. Seven minutes left to go in this half, but not really what people expected. Vermont five of their last seven from the field, but the Bulldogs are five of their last six. Catamounts need to come up with a couple of stops. Vermont has won three straight against Yale. And as mentioned, Anthony Lamb averaging about 25 points a game against the Bulldogs. But today, it's been all of creating that body contact. Each team has two timeouts remaining.